Let's look at some of the ways to use the MRR module in Revenue Story. This module contains the basic recurring revenue metrics that let you keep track of the performance of your subscription business. For example, there's the total MRR, new, upgrade and cancellation MRR and net MRR growth. Most of these metrics are available as KPIs as well as charts and in different time period granularities. There are also readily consumable segmented reports such as the total or new MRR by sales agent, by plan or customer type. The net MRR growth chart at a quick glance helps you understand how fast your business is growing. It has the new MRR, upgrade, reactivations and free to paid MRR and cancellation and downgrade MRR in a stacked bar chart. The spline represents the net MRR growth which is calculated by subtracting the sum of cancellation and downgrade MRR from the sum of new upgrade reactivation and free to paid MRR. You can use the various filters to dig deeper. You can use the country filter to figure out which region your MRR is coming from or the customer type filter to find out which type of customer your MRR is coming from and which type of customers are churning. One of the ways to look at your business performance is by segmenting your customers into different groups based on their MRR. For example, you can create segment for your low, mid and high value customers. To do this, you can go to current MRR filter under subscriptions, pick an MRR range for your low value customers, say 0 to 300 and save this as a segment. Now pick a different MRR range for your mid value, say 300 to 500 and save that as a segment. And another one for your high value, say 500 plus. Now you can track the performance of these three customer groups by simply switching between these different segments.